The hear the word of God, do not harden your heart as in the day of provocation. When your fathers kept that being the word of God, you need to understand this. What are you talking about? Don't harden your heart because God is calling you to Himself. Almighty God wants a relationship with you. Will you have a relationship with God, your Father? Will you? Accept forgiveness for your sins. Will you begin to walk the ways of righteousness through Jesus Christ? Jesus loves you. He cares about you. He doesn't want you to go to hell. That is why he died for you. But you must make your mind up. You need to make a choice. Let me ask you. Is there anybody here who heard the preaching of the word that wants to make up their mind to follow Jesus? Is there anyone here you want to follow Jesus? Anybody here? You're not a believer, but now you believe because you heard the word. Is anybody here brave enough to say yes? I will lift my hands to Jesus. Because on the judgment day, you'll be asked, did you hear the message? The Mary question is, pray what to Jesus. did you do with the no. message? How what can you do pray to our It's son? very important that you make a choice. How can the son of because mother be God? life is based on decisions. And a decision no, for no, Jesus Christ no, is a decision for life. I'm not talking about existence, our normal existence. I'm talking about the eternal son life. Son of that is what you is need. God. So please. Make a decision for Jesus Christ. Decide you will live your own life again. You will live the life God has for you. Because God has a new life for you. Think about your life. Up to this moment, you know you have done things you shouldn't do. You know it. We all live like that. But when Jesus comes, he wipes away your past and gives you a new beginning. And in this new beginning, you, hey, daily, he will use his blood it's to cleanse you. Because only the blood of Jesus can cleanse sins. Why are you blood Nothing thirsty? else. Blood, blood, Nothing blood. Blood. Nothing else will cleanse Did your God sins. Did God have to die? Yeah. Did God the have to shed his blood for The blood of Jesus Christ. God can just because the devil about. knows if that by the blood of Jesus of Christ Jesus and the words of our testimony, of God. we hey, overcome the devil. The blood of Jesus. Oh, 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 the blood of Jesus, it washes what I saw. There is power in the blood of Jesus. There is power in the blood of Jesus. There is power in the blood. Of Jesus, are you praying? It was the Jesus. Why are you singing the preachers? Oh, the blood of Jesus. Blood, blood, oh, blood, blood, the blood, blood of Jesus. Oh, the blood of Jesus. Blood, blood. Oh, the blood of Jesus. Blood, blood. Oh, Listen, the blood of Jesus is powerful. Satan is afraid of the blood of Jesus Christ. I plead the blood of Jesus in speaker's corner. I plead the blood of Jesus over your soul to wake you up. Blood of Jesus, wake them up. Blood the darkness. Destroy the darkness because the blood is speaking of your salvation. The blood is speaking of your salvation. The blood says, I'm quitted, I'm quitted. Clean, clean. Will you accept the blood? When you accept the blood, it will purge your conscience from dead works. Look, religion cannot change your conscience. You know it yourself. 
You feel guilty every day. You feel guilty. You know it yourself. But when you come to Jesus, the blood of Jesus will purge your conscience from dead works. All of a sudden, now you can serve God acceptably because you know the blood will purge your conscience. And if you should sin, you confess your sins to the Father. And because you confess your sins, He will cleanse you from all your sins and from every manner of unrighteousness. And I pray for Speaker's Corner. I come against the darkness in which Speaker's Corner. The darkness here that holds men captive would allow them to open their hearts. We rebuke the darkness in the name of Jesus. That people come here to listen to foolishness instead of hearing the truth. We rebuke those lies of the devil. Father God, silence those who speak the lies and give a voice to those who speak the truth. Confound the foolishness in Speaker's Corner. May Speaker's Corner be a place for the voice of God. May Speaker's Corner be a place for the power of God. May Speaker's Corner be a place for salvation. Salvation to Jesus Christ and Speaker's Corner. And the darkness confounded, the darkness overthrown. For Jesus Christ is the King of our kings and the Lord of our lords. May God bless you. Thank you so much. Thank you.